remember that one of the first times I talked to you was uh, you weren't happy about uh, the OS DL because they were evil or whatever it was back then, and and that fell apart. And then you know you helped start the Linux Foundation. We're what seven, eight years into the Linux Foundation. Um, were you happy with the way things have worked out with these guys? Jim is awesome. Yeah. Um, I think I don't I don't know how much we talked about the OSDL at the time, but I think one of the one of the issues I had with it was that they were trying to present themselves as only Linux, and they were going to companies to say, if you pay us, then we'll make this happen, which they couldn't. Yeah. And Jim obviously doesn't do that, right? And so his approach is more. How can we help Linux and the Linux community to create a better ecosystem for Linux? And LinuxCon and maintaining the kernel summit and organizing these events runs really well. They're doing a great job with very little money. And so he's, um, I think he's been very good at, at having a, a more uh, formal organization on, around the Linux community, involving companies but also involving individuals having the ability that both people get together yeah. uh, without an agenda, right? And, and you know, even though here companies do present and, sure, sure. and you'll feel some of that in, in keynotes, it's still mostly about people working together. And as long as he keeps doing that, it's good. Good, because since you're on the board, you're, uh, yeah, that's right. You, you could <laughs> vote him off. He's, no, he's great. You know, yeah, no, I agree. His okay. heart's in the right place, yeah. and, and, and he tries to do a good job. And I think OSDL, they couldn't care less about the community, it was a business. 